I should have listened to Elizabeth and banished you months ago. No, instead, I thought it would be better to keep you close where I could see you, but as it turns out, that was just an exercise in futility because you have proved that you can effectively stir up mayhem from any distance. So tell me, what is it you think you've unleashed on me and my family now? Oh, your family? Is that what you're calling these pathetic people? The simpering slut Elizabeth and her children by two different fathers? Yes, you have done what I suspect. And what might that be? Oh, come on, you hate Elizabeth, and the fact that I have a child with her makes you ill, doesn't it? But with Aiden out of the equation, my long-term connection to Elizabeth would cease to exist, no? Well, now that's brilliant. I, I, I wish I had thought if of If you that. helped Franco kidnap my son, I will kill you. I have done nothing. Nothing but love you from the moment you were born. Yet you continually reject me and treat me with disrespect. Well, there's a myriad of good reasons for that. You know, Nicholas, I came here today to do you a kindness, but I've decided you don't deserve it. Now, you stay with your brood mare and her, her crop of, of illegitimate little ragtags. You are a disgrace to the Cassadine family. Your father would be mortified. You hold on. You swear. You swear to me. On your precious Stavros's name that you're not keeping my son from me. I swear to you on Stavros's name, his grave, and his life. I'm not keeping your son from you. I don't like to bandy my son's professional name around. People are attracted to celebrity. It makes it hard to sort out who your real friends are. Yeah, I never thought about it that way. I can tell that you, uh, you love your son a lot. I do. He hasn't always made it easy. Bobby was a difficult child. Mm. But he's a decent man with a good heart. And now I have a fresh start with Pablo. Did Bobby help you with the adoption process? You're asking too many questions. And they're odd. I can't imagine you no. need this information for the Census Bureau. I didn't mean to pry, ma'am. I, I want you to leave. I, I'm really, I'm terribly sorry. Please if I could just go. ask you a few more questions. Really, just a, just a few minutes. about Franco. I know that Spinelli's working with Jason to find him and now a baby's missing. And if you recall, Franco has this freaky obsession with Jocelyn, so the sooner he's found, the better I'll sleep. No, I completely agree. I gotta get going. Thanks for stopping by. I hope it helped. And um, I'm sorry about Jason and just know that Dante tried everything he could to keep Jason out of Penfold for yeah, as long as possible. Okay. It's okay, I, I know. And I appreciate that Jason was out for as long as he was, and Jason's a tough guy, so if anyone can handle it, he can. Okay. Well, love you. That was sheer brilliance. Ah. I was afraid the Valkyrie was going to give it all away, but you, yeah. you recovered with nerves of steel. I'm good. Well, the jackal bows. <laughs> and you're about to see how good I am. I'm not gonna stop until Dante pays for what he did to Michael. Well, after reviewing every scrap of paper related to this case, I must concede. Jason Morgan's transfer is in order. <laughs> Finally. Oh, there's just uh, one other one other thing, Detective Domestico. Jason Morgan was initially released into Detective Falconeri's custody, and he must be returned to Pentonville the same way. It's all right here in the judge's writ, in case you'd like to look at it. No, I'm all set. Go coddle your killer. All right, you're getting real good at it. If Santos Lopez believes you whacked his brother, he's coming after you. I don't know, see, that's the thing. He's not going to believe it. He can't afford to believe it. That's the thing that Sonny missed. The Lopez family and I, we've established a pretty good relationship. The rules are fairly clear. And within those rules, there's autonomy, and the profits are sky high. That's the most important thing. 
Santos Lopez. If he thinks I'm the enemy, he goes crawling back to Sonny. And that means at the very least, he's giving Sonny a bigger cut. Lopez is too cheap and prideful for that. You made a serious mistake. You might not survive this one. I'll tell you what, Jason. Once I get rid of Sonny, you can come work for me. So, what's his charity? The Alliance to Save Exploited Children. Brenda's into it? Yeah. Heart, mind, body, and soul. Seems like the work has really grounded her. Brenda grounded? That's hard to imagine. Well, don't get me wrong. She's still a wild, crazy girl. Just with a little bit of added gravitas. Wow. Yeah. Well, I wrote down her uh, email and her phone number for you, just in case you uh, wanted to you know, <laughs> drop her a note. All right. I don't think that's a good idea. Why not? Well. Come on. Oh. Okay, I, I have to take this. I gotta go. But I just wanted you to know that I ran into Brenda in Africa and she was not lolling around on the zebra skin getting ready for a photo shoot. Makes a trip, eh? See ya.